Hello everybody and welcome back to Undertale. Where I just went back to the shop and I got back my nice creams because we died in the last episode and someone very thoughtfully put in the comments that I had lost all my nice creams. So I went back to the shop and I got some more. So now we've got a little maze to go through. Oh yeah, of course. We need to redo this conversation. <clears throat> Hello? No, that's not his voice. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> Hello, this is Papyrus. Remember when I asked you about clothes? Well, a friend who wanted to know, her opinion of you is very, uh, murdery. But I bet you knew that already. And because you knew that, I knew when you said, I'm not wearing a dusty tutu. It was really a secret code. You really meant, I actually am wearing a dusty tutu. You were trying to protect yourself, while making it so I didn't have to lie. I picked up on this and followed your plan. I told her you were not wearing a dusty tutu. In fact, I took it one step further. I told her you were probably Wearing a faded ribbon. Of course, you would never wear that. But that's the point. She won't recognize you now. And I didn't have to betray either of you. Since I just told her what you said. Wowie, you're such a smart cookie. I really can be friends with everyone. Oh, Papyrus. Okay, I hope you guys didn't mind hearing that one again. Oh, we're fighting. Aaron. Uh, we have to have a flexing fight with Aaron, don't we? So we have to go... Flex. I flex. Aaron flexes twice as hard. Not very good reflexes today. I have better days than others with my reflexes on this. Okay, ready for my next flex. Mm. Aaron is ready for my next flex. gold every time he does that so it's kind of handy but now I don't have very much in the way of health and where am I going I do not know I do not know where I go the power to take their souls this is the power that the humans feared That would be kind of scary. Look who it is. Look who it is. It's a scary little beast. It's Onion Sun. Hey there. Noticed you were here. I'm Onion Sun. Onion Sun, you're here. You're visiting Waterfall, huh? It's a great here, huh? You love it, huh? Yeah, me too. It's my big favourite. You're kind of annoying, Onion Sir. Even though the water's getting so shallow here, I have to sit down all the time. But. He hey, that's okay. It beats moving to the city and living in a crowded aquarium, like all my friends did. You're a bit lonely. And the aquarium's full. Uh, uh, anyway, so even if I did, if I wanted to, I 
that's okay though, you hear? Undyne's gonna fix everything, you hear? I'm gonna get out of here and live in the ocean, you hear? I hope you do get to live in the ocean. Hey, there. That's the end of this room. I'll see you around. Have a good time. In waterfall. Oh, who have we got now? Shiren. Hides in the corner, but somehow encounters you anyway. Yay. No doubt in an awkward manner. Okay, so. I don't know Shiren's thing. Hum, I think. I hum a jazz ballad. Shiren follows your melody. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, I need some help there. Wow. Uh, Shireen seems much more comfortable singing along. Ah, I, oh, I could have done Mercy straight away. Yay! Must have 30 more gold. Okay. It's definitely worth trying to do these fights because a Cine Bunny is worth 20 gold. This is the piano puzzle. But I need the I need the tune first. It's a statue. The structures at its feet seem dry. Very well. Did I miss the Oh yeah, I have to give it an umbrella, don't I? So, there's an umbrella. Yes, please. And we'll give it to the statue. Inside the statue, a music box begins to play. Okay, there are my instructions. Music continues and doesn't stop. Off I go. Right. I was a clever cookie and I wrote that down. <laughs> uh, I think I should have read this the other way around. Hang on. Uh, go away. Okay, right. Let's read this one first. This power has no counter. Indeed, a human cannot take a monster's soul. When a monster dies, its soul disappears. And an incredible power would be needed to take the soul of a living monster. And then we read this. There is only one exception. The soul of a special species of monster called a boss monster. A boss monster's soul is strong enough to persist after death. If only for a few moments. A human could absorb this soul. But this has never happened. And now it never will. Oh, I should have read that one first. Oh no, okay, the northern room hides a great treasure. It doesn't. Yes. Oh, it's enter to play. Alright, it's so enter to play. Was it why was it? Oh, maybe I need to leave the piano. How'd I get away from it? Uh, X. Okay, all right, try again. Uh, 
Now I know what I'm doing of it. Pretty sure that's what it said. Um, we'll try one more time and then I'll go back. I did this a lot more easily last time, I seem to recall. Done it wrong again. the sign. It's a legendary artifact. Will you take it? Sure, you're carrying too many dogs. No! Have I got a dog in my inventory? Yes, I do. I deployed the dog. The dog absorbs the artifact. The artifact is gone. I don't know where that dog comes from because there's no, uh, like, way to put him in a box or anything. I don't know if there was a trick to that dog. But oh well, the artifact is gone now. I have fun playing that puzzle anyway. Oh, this rain is terrible. Hi kid! Yo, you can't hold an umbrella either? If you're walking anyway, I guess I'll go with you. Ha ha! Let's go! People ask me where these voices come from. Uh, I don't know. Man, Undyne is so cool! She beats up bad guys and never loses. If I was a human, I would wet the bed every night, knowing she was going to beat me up. Ha ha! That should have been ha ha! <laughs> Echo flower. So, one time, we had a school project where we had to take care of a flower. The king, we had to call him Mr. Dreamer, volunteered to donate his own flowers. He ended up coming to school and teaching the class about responsibility and stuff. That got me thinking. Yo, how cool would it be if Undyne came to school? She could beat up all the teachers. That's great. Now let's move. Let's go. Um, maybe she wouldn't beat up the teachers. She's too cool to ever hurt an innocent person. And she's trying to hurt me. And I don't think I did anything wrong except fall under a mountain. Bye, kid. I really do think that castle looks like the, the uh, Disney castle. That's to put your umbrella away, I'm guessing. Can I have a ride up there, kid, please? Yo, this ledge is way too steep. Yo, so you want to see Undyne, right? Climb on my shoulders. Okay. Thanks, kid. Yo, you go on ahead. Don't worry about me. I always find a way to get through. Uh, and land on your face. I'll see you later, dude. 
the serene sound of a distant music box. It fills you with determination. Let's go read these. It went all dark when I went to read them. That's very odd. Okay, the humans, afraid of our power, declared war on us. They attacked suddenly and without mercy. In the end, it could hardly be called a war. United, the humans were too powerful, and us monsters too weak. Not a single soul was taken, and countless monsters were turned to dust. Oh, yes. Right, I'm going to have one run at this. And if I can't make it through, um, I'll probably end the episode there. Maybe a couple of goes. We'll see how we do. This is hard. This is very, very hard. <laughs> run, she love, run. Run away from Undyne Spears. Because they are terrifying. Damn it. Oh, that was lucky. Dead end. lost in this thing. <clears throat> How do I get out? Ah. Finding the way is the worst. The more frustrated I get at the fact I can't find my way, the worse this gets. Why can't I go down? No, 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 no. I don't know, that might be it for me. Yeah. I have to try and remember the way. It's not too bad because it gives you a save point right before it. I never expected to do that in one go. Okay, we'll have one more try. Then I'll end the episode and then we'll spend probably the whole of the next episode trying to do this. This is one of the worst puzzles in the game, I think. Let's go this way to start with. It's a dead end now as well. Great.
Okay, run, run, run. Ah! No, I was so close. That was the way. That was the way. Okay, I definitely found my way a little bit quicker that time than I did the last time. But I think I'm going to end the episode here. And then we're going to have a few more goes in the next episode. And we'll see how far we can get, okay? So, hope you liked the episode. And if you did, then please me leave me a like in the comment section below. And if you want to see how well I do at this puzzle next time, hopefully it won't be too many more goes before I crack it. And uh, then please subscribe to the channel. I can let you know when the video is out. Um, but in the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.